Hello friends and welcome back to the channel. Today I am finally sharing our house tour. So we moved into this home in July and it has taken us quite a while to feel settled, to get things mostly unpacked, put away, to organize a little bit. There's still so much to do and we have guests coming in a couple weeks, which is very exciting. We can't wait but we still have a lot to do before they get here. So I'm gonna show you the house as is just because you all deserve to see it at this point, but keep in mind that a lot will be changing over the next few months while we live here. It's very comfortable. We're very happy with it after seeing many places that we did not like. This one felt safe and like us and like we could make it our own. So we're really happy to be here. Once you enter, you come into this big foyer Hopefully it's not too echoey. I want to put a table right here with a plant and like a light of some kind, either an art light or a lamp. Not sure, but some kind of light right here. We've got this cute runner from Amazon and our pile of pictures that still need homes. And then you come into our living room. I really like this room. Um, I like how big and bright it feels. We've got our original furniture, which you remember from our old videos, probably if you've been here that long. A big, beautiful Monstera. And this room still needs a rug and a coffee table. And then maybe another seat over here. If you have an idea what kind of seat to go in here, I would love recommendations because I am struggling and I don't know what to put there. But we could really use more seating for when people come. And then over here we've got Maple's toy basket, plant, lamp, and then our entertainment area. I, I love this. This is one of my favorite areas in the home. Got our frame TV and then our cabinet that the movers broke, but Steve fixed and they did pay us for it. To the right of the living room, you come into our kitchen. Here we have a hook for Maple's leash and key, our keys, and then Maple's dishes, of course. I love that the cabinets are white. And then this spot is one of my favorite areas in the home as well. It makes me so happy. Our dining table and chairs are antique. We got them on Facebook Marketplace. <laughs> the tablecloth I got on H&M and I love it. It's linen, but it was like $20 or something. It was really cheap. And then I just love this little vignette. It makes me so happy. And out back, we have a nice little patio. We have done nothing with it. So anyways, that's, that's what it looks like. And then around here, you've got the door to our garage. A little hallway, my cuckoo clock from Germany. Down here is the basement. That is where Steve is currently working. It's kind of his workspace slash our storage, of course. And then this is our half bath, which has been so nice. We're used to having one bathroom. So having one and a half, while we would love like two, two and a half, one and a half is a huge step up. Steve's dad painted that picture and so we knew we had to hang it somewhere where everyone would see it. And then we'll go upstairs. So once you come upstairs, you have a linen closet right at the top of the stairs. All of the closets need more organizing. That one is the best one. <laughs> We've got a couple of these hanging in the hall up here. I just need to find the perfect candles for them and I want to add some rub and buff to kind of make them feel more vintage. So this is our bathroom. We added this mirror and it has come a long way. We have a new shower curtain coming, so hopefully that'll be here this week. The bathroom has come such a long way from when we first moved in. It looks so much better. It's just cuter, feels more like us. Very happy with how it's coming together. And very happy that we have such a great landlord that lets us do this. And then you go down the hall, a couple pictures I want to hang, our Pira, of course, stool that Steve got in Uruguay, and then you come into the guest bedroom slash Steve's office. I got this painting at an antique fair in Massachusetts. It was such a fun find. It was only $20. And then um, the plant is from Steve's sister. Like all of our plants, the stool I just picked up on Facebook Marketplace for $4. And then Steve's desk, also Facebook Marketplace find. The chair comes from our dining set. We need a chair for him. Also the cute little whale. To the right of Steve's desk is our guest bed that is unfinished. It's a Facebook Marketplace find and the side table is free from Steve's dad, so that worked out. 
The chest was my grandmother's. It is broken, also a work in progress. All of these blankets go inside it, so, you know, eventually this room will be ready to go. And here you have our laundry. It is literally just a washer and dryer, so I'm not gonna show you. But then you come into our bedroom. This room I really am liking. It still is missing a few things, but I'm really happy with where it's at. This is our original bed. We, I love it. It's a new mattress. Steve loves it. And over on this wall we have some pictures that Steve has taken, my three favorite that he's taken. So I love having them in our room where I can see them all the time. Although I wish they were also in a place where guests would see them all the time. But eventually I do want to get sconces to put on this wall and curtains and a full length mirror over here and a rug. And there's our closet and my hats and a step stool because I can't reach the shelf in the closet. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope that you enjoyed this video and getting a peek into our home. If you have any ideas for our space or suggestions on the seating in the living room or the guest bedroom or anything, leave them in the comments because sometimes I feel at a loss at what to do next or how to put things together. So <laughs> leave your suggestions and recommendations. If you want to know where anything is from, just leave it in the comments and I'll be sure to try to link everything I can. Thank you for watching and I hope you have a very great day and stay tuned for more home videos, more travel videos, and all of those good things. Bye!